just like life's little moments, you know, that maybe you don't pay a lot of attention to every day, but, but if you stop and, and just look and listen, you'll, they're all over the place. My name is Chris Bosk. I am a, a singer-songwriter. I play solo under a stage name Alphonsine and in a band uh, called The Moonlit Wild. And I'm here today at uh, Cinder Sound Studios with my, my buddy John McVeigh working on a, a new album. And right around 10 or 11, I, I started, you know, picking up Dad's guitar and that, that was just, you know, it never, never turned back. When I was a boy, Mom and Dad would pack the car. I lived in New York in the late the 90s, early 2000s, and I lived a sort of like bohemian life. And it wasn't until after I moved home from New York, like in 06, that I started thinking, you know, I have all these, I have songs, and I, I need to figure them out and, and, and start working through that. I started playing out mostly in and around Lafayette. Coffee shops, breweries, house concerts, then the band got together, we started doing, you know, bigger things in different places, and yeah, that the live thing kind of grew out of the albums that I made over the last 10 years. When I first started playing out, uh, it was ner really nerve-wracking for me. I mean, part of it is gaining comfort with your own material, and, and then part of it is just being comfortable being in front of people. Like I, <laughs> I can remember being in in the you know waiting to go up somewhere and just you know like how am I going to play this with my hand shaking like this you know? But um, you know you get get through those those early ones, and, and then it turns into. Um, something that's a lot more fun. Playing your own stuff is has higher risk and higher reward. Well, I'm flying over Idaho. Because if people like it, then then that's amazing because it's a comment on something that you created out of whole cloth and if they don't like it, it it hurts that much worse because for the same reason right but to me that's that's what it's all about and I wish I was a light below because I know I would be better than if I find something that's true that's meaningful the the lyrics take care of themselves because you're already it's like you've already written it you know you just need to find out how to express it you're trying to create a sound that's unique to what you're doing and some of that's going to require lifting from your past my life when the moon is right i i woke up with there was a an idea in my mind and a and a, and a and a bit of language that just struck me in an interesting way. I want to tell you that I thought about all the things that you said. Like, I don't know why nobody said anything to me, you know, and sometimes when life is easy and good, you have to be, you have to look for the idea somewhere that may not be um, in a real place. You, it might be imagining what someone else is dealing with and you take that and and go with it, right? So I found this line and and I and I just filled out the rest of the, the, the verse and then I went and found something on guitar that I had done before and just saved and all right, let me pull this out and the next day, you know, I figured out a chorus and you're just kind of like piecing it together and at the end, you, you know, you look at it and is that a song? It's like being a craftsman, you know? You're like at a table, like tinkering with stuff. It forces me to figure out why it is that I, am drawn to something, why it is I feel a certain way, why it, it, is it that that makes me sad and that makes me smile, and, and it's like therapy without a, th a therapist. <laughs> this place is awesome, you know, there's a lot going on here, and Lafayette, it's a small community by comparison, you know, compared to Boulder and maybe even Longmont, but opportunities to to share and take in one's art, whether it be music or, or you know painting or poetry, are enormous. It's just like a, a community hub of 
like-minded people who, who, who are supportive and want to want to share. It's an awesome place to be a musician. I'm lost without you, all my blood is blue. In my heart it wanders back to sweet things you would do. I just try to, if I could buy a ticket, you know, let things there. happen the way they're meant to happen and put all my energy into creating, you know, the, what I want to create, you know, with the people that I want to create it with. And I believe more and more that, you know, if something's going to happen or not happen, that that's not really up to me. You know, it's not up to me having this many likes here, that many hearts. It's just, you know, the, I, I think the music will or will not take on a life of its own. And all you can do is, um, is give it the chance. And I'm always gonna be 